Today I will show you how to download ebooks from the library for your Kindle. To begin, you need to be at your computer and have your Amazon Kindle ready and also have your library card number with the PIN number or password you use to access your online account. In order to go to OverDrive, you can open up your browser and go to the website digital.minlib.net. Once there, make sure to first sign in where you can take advantage of the library purchasing copies for the Wellesley residents. In order to begin searching for the Kindle ebooks, you can go into the Advanced Search tab to the left and choose under Formats Kindle Book. And if you wanted to search for a specific title, you can type the title uh, or the author's name into the keyword search or if you just like to browse all of the books that are available you can click here to only show titles with copies available and then hit the search button. From here you'll see that we have 473 books that are available that are Kindle books right now. So we can scroll down and we'll see that we have the most recent Alvin Ho series, Allergic to Girls School and Other Scary Things in Kindle book format, which we can then add to our cards. We will proceed to checkout where we can choose the lending period from 7, 14 to 21 days. Since I'm a pretty fast reader, we'll go with 7 days we'll confirm the checkout and we're going to click on get for Kindle that now opens up the Amazon website and we will click on get library book it prompts us to sign into our Amazon account and asks us where we would like to deliver that. If you have several Kindles, you can choose from here. You could also, if you have the Kindle app installed on an iPhone or Android phone device, or if it's a new Kindle, you can register that, or you could also transfer to your computer and read on your computer. Now the delivery takes place wirelessly if you are connected to a Wi-Fi signal. Uh, it will download it the next time that you connect to that or if you'd like you could also deliver it to your Kindle via USB connection which would be connected from your computer to your Kindle so I'll just choose to send that to the Wellesley Free Library Kindle click on continue and as I said the next time that we connect to the Wi-Fi it's going to download to my Kindle. Now if I don't have a wireless signal I can choose to download now and it is now asking me to save the file so I'm just going to save that and it saved that to my downloads folder so from here I can open up Windows Explorer go into my downloads where I see the title of the book I'm going to copy that I'm going to go to my Kindle which I already have plugged into my computer go into my documents and I'm going to paste the title which is now available for me to read in my Kindle if I've already read the book and I've uh, done that before my lending period is up and I'd like to return it in advance I can go into Amazon under my digital items and I can manage my Kindle and here I have a list of all of the books that I have checked out from the library so we see here Alvin Ho I'll go to the actions tab 
Here I could always download and transfer via USB if that didn't work the last time. Uh, or I could uh, return this book, which is what I'm going to do. And yes, I'm sure that I want to return the ebook. And now that it's returned, I can choose to delete that from my library as well, so I won't have that cluttering up my list on uh, Amazon. So that is the end of our tutorial on how to search and download books for our Kindle via the library's OverDrive service. If you have any questions, feel free to call the reference desk at 781-235-1610, extension 1117.